Uh, here something happened to the stream. No, oh, there it is. I was about to say, I'm still, I haven't dropped frames yet, but like Discord is breaking on me. So I also don't see Discord. Yeah, you're coming through kind of choppy. Where, where did my Discord go? It's still open because I can hear you guys, but I don't see it. the window. There you guys are. Yeah, I don't know who to find now. I don't know. Military glitch. Yep. I wouldn't be surprised if Discord servers are exactly <clears throat> optimal. Yeah, especially since I'm sure they just dealt with a, a long day as well of extra life. That's true. Smart people are afraid of bugs. Yeah, no, I, I I agree. Smart people are afraid of bugs. Right, Tiffin. You should know. Yeah, Oh, oh that's gonna hurt. John, I'm sure you've heard plenty of stories about how the original game was just broken entirely. Yes. <clears throat> the way the um, the way the types were originally supposed to be laid out, um, psychic and dragon type were supposed to kind of square off against each other as peak special and peak physical. Mm-hmm. That was back when they were still designing the very basic game, back when gold and silver were still rolled into uh, red and blue. Yeah. But when they cut a bunch of stuff uh, from the original game so they could get it out on time, after they'd published the game, they realized they'd made a couple of mistakes. First, with dragon type, there weren't any dragon type moves that actually dealt damage as a function of any Pokemon stats. The only dragon type move that dealt damage at all only did 40 damage flat always. Great. And for psychic types, if I remember correctly, the only real weakness psychic types had in the original game were bug types. And bug types had no damage moves whatsoever. Oh uh, yeah, because they're they're like Caterpie and they don't. Yeah. They fixed that for gold and silver, but the original bug types just didn't do damage as bug types. So um Dragons looked awesome and had awesome stats, but couldn't actually use good dragon attacks. And Psychic had no real weaknesses, so. Psychic just entirely ran away with the game. What psychic types were there back then? Uh, the Alakazam line, the Hypno line. There were a couple. Okay. What was the best? Alakazam. Yeah. Always has been. You do have to trade to get him, though, but... Ah, this one you can just catch it. They're just some out in the wild. They're very rare, but you can find them in the wild. That's nice.
Just 38 more minutes, boys. Is that all? 522. <clears throat> That's doable. Aren't we glad we're ending it with something really easy? Non-brain required. You mean we want to go back and play Go? <laughs> no. Oh, what, do I want? what about 3D chess? We'll, we'll play some actual literal 3D chess. Uh, what's coming up next? Sleep. Man, that sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> and food. I'm so hungry. What Pokemon is coming up next? Uh, I don't know. Uh, it's a fairy type. It's gonna be Clefairy. Probably isn't actually. Clefairy didn't used to be a fairy type because there wasn't such a thing as a fairy type. Right, fairy type Is didn't it... happen until yeah. what, Gen 5? Gen 6? Gen 6. Gen 6, when they introduced X and Y. Is Clefairy now a fairy type? Yes. Yes. They went back and corrected a ton of the uh, original Pokemon to add in fairy types. When did Ice get added? Ice was one of the original Pokemon. Okay. I don't remember it. Yeah, I think Dark type was the newer ones. Like Dark wasn't originally. Dark was in Dark and Steel were introduced in Gen 2. Along with the quote unquote baby type. Baby? It isn't an actual type, but baby Pokemon were introduced in Gen 2. Oh. As in like the eggs and the hatchlings from them? Or? Baby horns, yeah. Uh, Magby, uh, oh, okay. Pelican. So the the first of the three forms. Previously, it was just the second and third forms. Yeah. yeah. I don't even know if there's a third yet. Yeah. So, so for example, I think or uh, Electivire four. I think Gen four introduced Electivire and Mag uh, Magwater. Yeah. The way it still works is you've got the. For example, you've got Pikachu as your basic Pokemon, and yeah. then Raichu is your stage one Pokemon. That hasn't changed, but now there's Pichu, which is a baby Pokemon, which evolves into Pikachu, which is still the basic Pokemon. Yeah. Which, most of those can only be acquired from breeding. You can't find the baby Pokemon out in the wild. Even then you have to use specific, like, items. No, thank you. No, wait! It's still Blizzard! Even if it misses one, it still hits So most. is Fairy the newest type? Fairy is the newest yeah. type since Gen 6. They haven't added a new one since. Instead, they've been adding different mechanics to the game instead. Like Dynamax. Dynamax, Mega Evolution, Demon. What is the difference between Dynamax and Mega Evolution? Dynamax only lasts for about three turns before your Pokemon shrinks back to its normal self. Which, Dyna certain Pokemon have Gigantamax, which is like Mega Evolution, but it's not. Yep. Which I still hate. That very Mega reason. Evolution is a a buff that is permanent for the duration of the battle that you can give to a single one of your Pokemon uh, at any time during the battle, as long as the Pokemon is the one that's currently out. And okay. if that Pokemon faints and you revive it, it's still going to be in its Mega Evolution form. So that Pokemon is going to be much er, significantly stronger, you know, faster, tougher um, than it would normally be. Okay. A mega evolution, um, sorry, um, a Gigantamax, Gigamax, I could never keep those two straight. Blank Max. Gigantamax. Yeah, uh, Gigantamax is when 
you use a similar power on a Pokemon, which gets, gives it an even bigger boost, but it's only good for three turns. And you can only do that once during the battle, same as with the Mega Evolution. <laughs> you got Dynamax, which is just like, you get bigger, your Pokemon just gets bigger, and lasts for three turns at this larger state with special, like, Dynamax moves. But then, like, you get Gigantamax, which is like a whole other, like, evolution of the Pokemon. In, in Dynamax form. Um, um, which only applies uh, by... I can't remember how um, Pokemon within a given species that are capable of Gigantamaxing instead of um, the normal version are pretty rare. You have to go hunt. Yeah. You have to go way out of your way to hunt for them, and even then, once you find them, you, it's the luck of the draw. What stats they have, whether they have any good moves, and so on. Yeah, and then they're they typically they always are guaranteed to have an exclusive move when they are in Gigantamax form. Okay. There is Z moves. Yeah, Z move is just a really powerful move that you can have any Pokemon. It, it's a really powerful buff. You can apply it to any single move that a Pokemon uses during a battle. You can only do it once during the battle, and it's only good for that one round. Yeah. And they have to have a move that matches the type of the, like, they have to be in the Pokemon has to be in possession of a stone that uh, can trigger the Z move. And I think the player even has to have his, that same crystal equipped for them to do it. So, like, you have to be dedicated to, this is the move I want to use. I think it's just the stone on the Pokemon. So you can give your My six team. Pokemon, each of them a different stone, and then decide during the battle which one you want to use. Yeah. Because each move has got its own, like, different like, what it does, how it affects, and, like, what bonus effects it from like that. So Z moves and Mega Evolution are both kosher as far as competitive Pokemon is concerned, but Gigamax and Gigantamax have actually been banned from competitive Pokemon. Interesting. Though so everything's up in the open now that the new DLC is out. Like they've allowed everything until they can find out the new meta. And surprisingly, Reggie Rock is like top dog because. Of it's not the slowest, but it's it's bulky as hell. And when you get big and Gigantamax, it can withstand most, if not everything, and then uh, dish out like three, twice as much. I don't know why he wants it. He's still got a perfectly good Pokemon over there. Regirock, I don't know if you remember it from Gen 3, Gen 3, it is a robot that is also a rock. Its compatriots are Reg Ice and Registeel. And Regis Philbin. We don't talk about Regigigas. <clears throat> but is the price right? Oh, yes. Got a vile plume. I can survive this fight, which I should be able It's a steel type. Hopefully my ice type and water type allies can be in use. Well, I'm gonna call it a night for for us at Casa del Davis. So couldn't make it another thirty minutes? Uh yeah. Uh, we're just we're just we're not contributing anything. 
minutes, though. Oh. Well, I should have seen that coming. You forgot that poison doesn't work on steel? Yeah, I forgot that it's totally in the I thought I could at least toxic and like poison it, but no. no. Nothing. Good night, everybody. So, Night. Night. Go for the big ring, I guess. I don't need it. I don't have any damage. Taking it. Our teammates need Pokemon. Okay, fine. train first. Frick. Something's dying here.
So what are these resources you're getting from this? Uh, I'm getting dynite ore, which I can train in for, like, materials. Let me go talk to the vendor. I can get uh, EXP candies for, like, I can get the XL for three dynite ore, uh, wave pieces for three dynite ore, armorite. Uh, I can get, real good stuff is, like, I can get vitamins from dynite ore for only two dynite, uh, dynite. As well as, if you really want to get expensive, there is beast balls, if you really want those. Uh, bottle caps and ability patches. The ability patch is a new item that came out where it allows you to access uh, acquiring the hidden ability for a Pokemon. Similar to the capsule, but way better. I heard about that. What's the Beast Ball? Uh, Beast Ball is something from Sun and Moon where you can uh, catch uh, the Ultra Beasts. Mm. That's right. They were the ball only balls that could catch an Ultra Beast back in uh, Sun and Moon. Uh, in this game, they're just kind of decorative, and they have a ridiculously low catch rate. But like in here, it's a hundred percent guarantee to catch if you suggest, if you actually uh, beat it. All right, I think we got enough time to do maybe one more, and then I don't know. I'm so tired. I think we're both just about dead. Yeah. We're almost there. We're almost at the 6 a.m. mark. Not be useful to us, but it's obvious everyone wants the set. Yeah, that looks like a set pile. Versus what psychic legendaries are there? Uh, psychic legendaries. Let me check. Oh, Mewtwo. Yeah, Mewtwo is the obvious one. Um, you, another obvious one. Leoxus, Mesprit, Azel. Cresselia, Luxine, Necrozma, Cosmog. Go for the flinch. See, I don't think I'm gonna be fast enough to hit this thing. Galarian, oh Articuno, Lugia, Bellabine. Well, you can't catch the Galarian birds in the adventures. You can only catch them through the story. Yeah, I figured. Uh, Victini, I always forget that one exists. Tapu Lele. Oh, Tapu Lele? It's not very fun. We run into that. Uh, what, is, what is the other typing for Tapu Lele? Harry. Uh, Solgaleo, Lunala. Calyrex. Probably not going to run into that here. Uh, uh, Audios, Ladios, Jirachi. Yeah, I look like that. Yep. Yeah, there's a good chunk of them. And I'm dead. Because 
we decided to go against a grass type and I was a ground type. Ah. I never stood a chance. can't even get past Septa oh we beat Septile after losing two Pokemon. We're never making it to the end. Everyone was just excited for the idea of catching a Septile. Which I can't blend yeah. it. It's a Septile. Catch it with him. I know you want the Pokemon, but please think. <laughs> now you've got us against a Gigantamax Grimstar. I guess I'm getting to fit another one in, Tim. Yep. Because no one decided to use their brains. myself at it and hope I can beat it. Because a Gigantamax Grimstone is not going to be an easy win. gonna fall in bed for a day in the nuts. You're close.
Oh, and Jim's first. I have 5 HP, and we are not making it out of this alive until we don't. I'm gonna get wiped by a look at time. That's probably why. But my teammate got one. Hell, we had a raid earlier that had two teammates who had them, and I didn't get them. That's a lot of tough. Or the gigantic shrimp No. my question, Grimstone? Uh, no, we're definitely gonna keep this up now. I already have the Grimstone, so... Oh, no, 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 no!
that just weird shadows, or is that Grim Snarl shiny? On the dot. 24 hours. 24 hours of streaming. Let's go to bed. Yep. Talk to you later, Tim.